The new Extol Safety Pro Series is here, featuring the AP2 air purifier and the IF2 inline fan, two products designed to make your laser engraving workspace cleaner and safer. But the real question is, do they live up to the hype? Stick around and I'll break it all down, including how the AP2's six layers of filtration, including a washable cyclone filter, set it apart from other purifiers out there. Now let's start with the Safety Pro AP2 air purifier. This purifier boasts Extol's Super Cyclone system, which promises to extend filter life by 10 times longer. And to be clear, only the Cyclone filter is washable, but it's designed to prevent clogging and extend the lifespan of the other filters, which is a big win when it comes to saving money. Compared to most air purifiers out there, which tend to have fewer filtration layers, the AP2 stands out with its six layer system. This makes it more effective at capturing dust, fumes, and odors. It's built to handle nasty fumes from materials like acrylic and leather, and we'll get into how it performs later. Now on the outside of the unit, it actually kind of looks like a computer tower. Now I'm not trying to sound like a total nerd, but the design is cool. The recessed wheels at the bottom reduce the chances of it tipping over, and it rolls super smoothly. On the front, you've got a magnetic removable cover that snaps on and off easily, and the filters slide in and out with labeled handles. No guessing needed. Next, let's talk about the Safety Pro IF2 inline fan. This fan is compact, but it packs a punch with dual blades spinning at 14,000 RPM and 300% more suction power than a typical inline fan. Plus, it's six times smaller than traditional fans, but still delivers excellent performance. Now, we'll see how it holds up during testing, but on paper, it looks like a serious upgrade for anyone needing efficient smoke extraction. Now, digging deeper into the AP2, this six layer system is pretty cool. Let's look at what Extol did. Number one, we have the Super Cyclone filter, which is washable and reusable, blocking 99% of large particles. Number two is the pre-filter, which catches 90% of visible particles. Number three is the medium efficiency filter, which removes 95% of fine dust. Number four is the activated carbon filter, which stops 88.5% of harmful fumes. And number five is the ultra dense medical grade carbon mesh, which absorbs 97.97% of odors. Number six is the high efficiency filter, which filters out 99.97% of dust and allergens. So I'm pretty confident this is going to work great. Now let's get into the testing. I've hooked up the Safety Pro AP2 air purifier and the IF2 inline fan to my Extol P2S and we are going to test them with a variety of materials. And by the way, the P2S already has a strong exhaust fan. I really don't need an inline fan, but I'm going to use it anyway. Okay guys, I turned my background lights around to shine on the back of the P2S and I wanted to show you the IF2 that I mounted right here. Now on this side, I have my manual switch, which we can control in creative space. I want to show you the power of this. So we have a power button right here, and we're going to go to full force, which is number four. And just to show you how much this is blowing, let me show you this stuff. I mean, it's, it's knocking stuff right off the table. Okay, guys, we have creative space open, and let me direct your eyes over here. We are connected to the P2S, and if you notice under the accessory list, I have both the AP2 and the IF2 connected. Let's click on one of these, go down here, and look, this is the option menu for the AP2. And here we can adjust the airflow level, put it on auto or one of the four speeds, and I'm, I'm just going to leave it off right now. And something really awesome, guys, Creative Space is telling us the life on the filters. Of course, I have everything here at 100%, so if you're wondering if one of your filters are going bad or it's getting clogged up over time, you can just hop on here and look. I mean, how cool is this? I'm really excited. So as we go down to the IF2 inline fan, you can see we have some different options there. We can uh, put it on quiet mode, on manual, adjust the fan speed, and just some really cool settings there. So this is what it looks like inside of Creative Space. Okay guys, here we go. The air purifier automatically turned on. Guys, look at the dust being pulled out of there. That is absolutely insane. Okay guys, the inline fan and the purifier is running and I want you to look at the smoke. It is just being pulled out of there like crazy. I can definitely tell the difference in the airflow. 
but this inline fan and new purifier just I think takes it to a whole new level as far as how much vacuum is inside of the P2S or whatever laser you will be using. And if you have a cleaner work environment, the more sharper, crisper, and cleaner the cuts and engravings are going to be. Let me show you this cut quality, guys. And I promise I'm not trying to hype this up, but there is minimal to no charring on the edges. I can definitely tell a difference with this inline fan, but with my original P2S review, it already did a great job, but with the inline fan and that purifier, just helping smoke all the smoke out of there, suck all the smoke out of there, you can definitely tell the difference there and if you this was a simple project off of etsy but i know the people that i've showed to online absolutely went crazy in my stories and i'm going to be making some more of these and i could probably sell these for a decent profit since we are on a co2 laser that means we can engrave clear acrylic so i'm making this pumpkin here this whole engraving and cutting out took about 18 minutes so i know that this air purifier is getting a lot of debris I engraved the top of it, then I cut it out, and it did great, guys. I am going to put this up in Mom's November tree, which is her Christmas tree before Christmas, so um, we'll just call it the November tree. <laughs> I think it's going to look pretty cool up there with everything else that she has going on, so guys, this turned out to be a really awesome project. Now let's get to the stinkiest thing besides acrylic, and that is leather. Now this is some raw cowhide and I am using the same design I did with the acrylic. Now this took about five minutes to cut out. I have this power set pretty high and you can see the debris, smoke, and the fumes being pulled out there. And as I'm looking at this camera footage, guys, I am really pleased with this. And remember, you can use this purifier with other lasers. It's just not the Extol ecosystem you have to use it with. So if you have another brand laser, well, I would look and compare because I think this is going to give a lot of purifiers a run for its money from what I am seeing. So we got this cut out and it's looking pretty good. Now, let me be honest, most lasers is going to cut leather, but what I'm looking for here is these crisp, clean edges on this. And I mean, this is a straight up pass. I could not have asked for the laser to do a better job, but what we're focused on here is the smoke removal. And it did a great job. It, that is pretty cool for a piece of leather. I mean, you could take this and glue it up somewhere. So I may put this in the November tree as well. I'm not sure. We just finished up the testing and now I want to check the filters to see how they look. And the testing that I did was pretty strenuous. And uh, let's pull this open. I can definitely smell some of the odor in here. But this filter here, I'm not sure if my camera is picking up. It doesn't look that bad. Now if I turn it over, it's a little bit brighter on the back side compared to this other side is just a little bit yellowed but still all in all i ran this with all these testings probably about a little over an hour if i check the other filter here that's white now let's check the cyclone filter it's hard to tell about the dust in there i will have to take these screws out to wash it out but this captured most of the dust. Let's have a look in here. I know my camera is overexposed. I'm doing that so we can see in here, but we can see where the dust just went in there. So guys, I'm pretty impressed. Okay guys, after running through the acrylic, leather, and plywood, I'm pretty impressed. The AP2 really knocked down the odors and the cyclone filter did a great job at catching the big particles. The IF2 was small and quiet and you can see how it pulled all that smoke out of there. I mean, even compared to the already amazing exhaust fan in the P2S, it made it that much better. And given the circumstances, it wasn't that much noise. So who should consider the Extol Safety Pro series? Now, if you've got a laser engraving setup and you want to make your workspace cleaner, the Safety Pro AP2 and the IF2 fan are solid options. The washable cyclone filter on the AP2 saves you money and its six layers of filtration are more than advanced than what you'd find in most purifiers. The IF2 is compact, powerful, and worked as expected. I know we only tested a few materials, but I probably have about an hour total engraving time on this purifier, and we really need to look at it in the weeks coming up to see how it's going to perform. But so far, 
I think this is probably going to outlast any purifier on the market. I know there are a group of people that's just going to run their hoses outside and that can work, but there are also a lot of people out there if you are in an apartment complex in a room with no window, or if you are just really sensitive to smoke and things like that, a air purifier will be a great investment for you. So for a lot of people, I know it's going to make sense to get one depending on where you are at. I know personally for me, I cannot live without one and the AP2 just made it that much better. Now here's something important. The release date for the Safety Pro series is October 21st, 2024. And for just $1, you can put down a deposit and save some money. Now Xtool usually runs promotions when they launch new products. So this might be a good time to jump in and grab a deal. If you're interested, I've got affiliate links down below that help support the channel at no extra cost to you. Plus I'll keep those links updated with the latest deals and discounts. So thanks for hanging out and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell for more videos.